Where did I go wrong? I'm lost inside my head. When everything around me keeps on changing, and these broken thoughts are weak. I don't like to fly on my own. I need a little love sometimes. When the lights go dim and I'm outside in, she's the only one that still feels right. And she know how it goes. One day I'm the most. Next day I'm a joke. Hit it down that slope. Then I float to the coast with a lump in my throat. Say, would you stand your ground if I lose mine? Even if it takes me a long time to realize that I'm wrong and I'm singing a song with lyrics that don't rhyme. I keep fading away to a place that don't feel safe. Pray that I wake up one day. I'm falling to pieces. I'm breaking apart. I'm ready to fix this, but where do I start? Where do I start? What's up, good people? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Aga Grace D. I hope you guys are doing amazing. I'm doing uh, great here in Kigani, Rwanda, the land of a thousand hills. So, guys, on today's episode, I'm going to show you another one of the richest uh, neighborhoods we have in uh, Rwanda, Kigali. And, uh, guys, I'm in love with this area. It's so beautiful. And the fact that it's very, very developed, uh, starting from the roads. So, we are in the Rusarara area. This is among the richest uh, neighborhoods we have in this beautiful Kigali city. So, guys, if you're watching uh, this video, please uh, consider subscribing if you haven't. Please. I leave a like, comment, and share my videos. Stay tuned to learn more about this uh, beautiful area of Rusara. Guys, we are here in Arusara. It's a very quiet, guys. I'm even actually scared of uh, speaking uh, very loud because it's very quiet. And I'm asking my friend, why is it very quiet? And he's telling me, rich people don't uh, love their noise. If you're rich and you're watching this video, can you please tell me if that's true? You know, because I'm used to living in areas where they have uh, so much noise. You know, and at least. Uh, with that, um, assured that there are other people living around me. So, Rosara is uh, very beautiful, and as I told you guys, Rwanda is uh, green. Doesn't matter where you are, and you, you can see also they have like grasses all well taken care of, and uh, the streets are very clean. They have pavements and nice roads, nice houses. If you're living in uh, Rosara and you're watching uh, this video, tell me how it feels to live in such a beautiful neighborhood and a very quiet one. The whole area is tarmacked and I was saying ah, the government is a little bit unfair <laughs> in my area Masoro village when going in we don't have a tarmac road but I got here and I was like what? Is this like a neighborhood? Or, and I was like oh my goodness they should do the same in Masoro village.
so guys as you can see uh, Risororo has a very very nice uh, modern houses and I like it and maybe one person would ask why is this girl always like you know like going to different neighborhoods in uh, Kigali the fact that I go to these uh, different neighborhoods it's uh, for me to show you if Kigali has uh, done it in a period of uh, 26 years you know why not other African countries? I mean, they're doing a, a great job. Uh, there are still uh, new apartments under construction, and I just love it. All these Akigali has done in a period of 26 years. And I'm like, there are people who watch Kigali and you think there's now much of you to do here in uh, Kigali. For me, just having a walk in such a neighborhood uh, makes me feel great. Missing people making it in life makes me feel great. I think, uh, I tell to myself that people's achievement and them achieving their goals and you know having what they have really wanted in life it makes me feel happy because also sometime in life when I see myself there and I hope I'll have people clapping for me so at this moment I'm just uh, clapping for people here in Kigali because they've done an amazing job I know it's not the all the areas that look like this but at least we have so many areas with a very beautiful apartment very nice uh, neighborhoods for you to come and visit or uh, maybe live there for like a day or two a week or whatever time that you want to live there mm -hmm. guys i'm being told that this year is nearly 10 years old and i'm like oh my goodness all this that you see here, most of it, maybe let's say 50% is uh, things that people did uh, during COVID time. During COVID, uh, things were hard on my side and I'm surprised during uh, the same COVID, there were people out here building uh, mansions in a Rusororo area. And guys, I've been to different, different neighborhoods in uh, Kigali, Rwanda. And I think uh, this is one of the best countries that I can invest or have you know a place for me a plot a land and you know come up with a, ma a very a beautiful mansion because uh, why not i would want to live here the place is uh, very peaceful i haven't heard of any crimes for the time that i've been here in rwanda since september 27th till today i haven't uh, come across you know with the uh, snatchers on the street i've been walking at night by myself and I've been safe and that is one of the reasons as to why I say in the future when uh, God blesses me because I'm so guys I've always wanted to invest in real estate and I've always wanted to re invest in a cool uh, country a country that uh, there's no chaos and everything else and Rwanda is one of those uh, countries I know I haven't been to different as uh, so many countries in Africa but for me I've fallen in love with Rwanda Kigali to be specific. So if I had to invest, I would invest in Kigali and Msanze. One of another reason as to why we would invest in Msanze is because it's a tourist attraction uh, town. So you know, you want to get money. For me, I've been to Kigali. If you're out there, maybe you're not in Africa, you're in Africa in a different country and you're looking for a good and the best place for you to invest, this is the right time to invest in Kigali because the prices are still very, very affordable. In the next uh, few years to come, uh, prices will be very high and uh, most of us won't be in a position to afford such uh, places in such areas here in Kigali. So if you're looking to invest, Rusororo, Kigali, Msanze is the place to be from uh, Grace uh, Advice. Uh, you know 
I'm not an investor like you know I'm just investing on my YouTube but let me tell you one of the biggest investments that you can have in your life for what I've learned from my mom and uh, people around me uh, and, and to most places that I've traveled properties and land are most of the biggest uh, investment that you can have in life one of the reasons being uh, land and properties they will always appreciate no matter what they'll never depreciate let's say you go in like the village that i live you buy a lunch today in the next few years to come the price will be higher or different from the price that you bought it the first time you bought it so uh, i've loved this area it's a good a place for you to invest maybe you're sitting there and you have a lot of money and you don't know where to take the money maybe come and invest in one of these uh, beautiful places we have in kigali or any other part that you feel is better in africa so guys uh, this is gonna be the end of uh, today's video if you watched uh, this uh, video and you haven't subscribed please uh, consider subscribing subscribing also don't forget to leave a like comment and share my videos i love you guys thank you for supporting me see you on the next episode